So, uh, Prashant, yes, can you tell me something about yourself? Yes, ma'am. I am Prashant, a structural engineer from Tamil Nadu. I have three years industrial experience in the field of civil and structural engineering. I have completed my master's in structural engineering in the year 2008 and secured 88 percentage of marks. And I completed my bachelor of engineering in civil engineering in the year 2016 and secured 85 percentage of marks. Um, and also I have took a course in port and harbor structures while I am working in IIT Metros for the three years. And I secured first mask in that course. Mm, and that's it, ma'am. Okay. Okay. So you have cleared your graduation in 2016, right? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. After that, you were working. After that, I have completed my post graduation, ma'am. Post graduation. So uh, you uh, like cleared your post graduation in probably 2018, and after that, uh, you have like around three years of experience, right? You're yes, work right now. You're working, or you left that job? I left the job, ma'am. Right now, I'm not working. Okay. And why you left that job? Uh, to concentrate more on uh, self preparation on government exam preparations, ma'am. For that, I have left from there. And I okay. took my preparation on government exam preparation. Okay, so like uh, you were working for around three years in a certain organization. Uh, still, you were looking for government jobs and like preparing for the government uh, organizations. Why? Were you not satisfied with your current organization? Not like that, ma'am. Uh, it is uh, mm -hmm. on temporary basis. So mm -hmm. I want to diverse my skills in various sectors. Where the rights having all those departments. For that, I have led the job and uh, put my effort on preparations, ma'am. Okay. Okay. So, what you learn from your three years of experience in that organization? From that, uh, I have learned many uh, civil engineering principles, theories. So many I have learned from that, ma'am. Mm, especially how to coordinate in meetings how to uh, guide the junior engineers, mm -hmm. how to cope up with the teams, various mm -hmm. team members. That and all I have learned from there. Ma okay, okay. So uh, like uh, you have learned so many things. Can you give me a name of three qualities that you think that embedded in you during your working experience or from your experience? Yes, ma'am. Three qualities. Um, Punctuality and coordination, main skill that I have learned from IIT Madras. Mm -hmm. um, a quality assessment, I should be more responsible to my position. Responsibility I have learned. And third thing is um, um, how to work ethically. Ethical mm. working I have learned. Okay, so do you think that uh, these of your three qualities will help you in this organization as well? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Definitely, it will help me. Okay. Okay. So, uh, you told me that you are from like Tamil Nadu, right? Yes, ma'am. Uh, like from which city? Uh, uh, actually, uh, district Kalakuchi district. It's near Salem. Okay. Okay. Yes, okay. Can you give me like uh, one thing that is... Uh, like a, a tourist place or some kind of like a very happy place in your uh, city or your nearby place? Uh, yes, ma'am. On Thiruvannamalai Temple. Uh, Thiruvannamalai hmm. Temple is nearby. Okay, so, uh, so you so you will recommend that when if, if I want to visit there, so you will recommend me that temple? Yes, ma'am. Huh? Okay. Yes, oh, what is the importance of that temple? Um, it is uh, constructed around 1918 B.C. 800 BCs. Mm -hmm. uh, we have four phases Siva statue. Uh, okay. It is familiar for that man. Okay. Uh, well, familiar. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, so, uh, Prashant, as you were like, uh, uh, like training your juniors as well, helping your juniors as well. So, can you tell me a situation where you feel that it is very difficult or some of your junior is like uh, not listening to you or might be in some other states? So, how, how you tackle that situation? Yes, ma'am. Actually, in my civil engineering field, if you are going to place a concrete in slab roof or any structural member, 
we have to ensure the workability condition of the concrete for that initially the engineer has to take a sample and have to test a slum cone test map the workability test is ensured for the placing that should be ensured but my junior engineer have missed that place uh, before checking the workability of the concrete so i have instructed them to check all the initial precautions to be taken before placing the concrete yeah. that's the situation i have faced ma'am and i have instructed to do properly in all the checklist manner ma'am okay 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 so prashant uh, because this is your first interview so i'm not going to ask you more questions i will like give you the feedback for the questions that i have asked so that you can prepare accordingly because just on 11th of august you are going to have an interview so i want you prepare so much because you have like uh, 10 days only left right yes. so i don't want to like puzzle you in more and more questions i just want that the questions which i have asked you should prepare that first okay okay ma'am so now maybe you feel that some of the questions were not relevant to the uh, like organization or well as i asked you for the uh, your city details the place of your city that is related to the current affairs we don't know there will be like five or seven members in the panel they can ask you any type of question okay so the some uh, this uh, i was asked you to tell me a place in your city that you will recommend me to like move or uh, to see that will be related to the history like your general knowledge like how much you are aware about your place okay so first we are going to start with the introduction firstly okay. you have to prepare the introduction prashant your introduction was not that good okay okay we do have a introduction video on our youtube channel you can go through that okay yes. how you have to introduce yourself we have like segregate the compartments like you have to tell your name then some your uh, uh, study academics then your work experience your achievement or uh, some kind of industrial training if you have but as you have experience then you can also go with your experience and what you have achieved in that job okay and okay. please Uh, like you have to remind that because you are an experienced person so there must be so many questions that will be related to your experience and that will be situational based from experience there will be two types of question one will be the practical that what you learn from this can you tell me this process in brief or in practically as you have experience in the same thing kind of like and one will be the situational as i asked you that one of your junior is not working or not listening to you so how will you tackle that situation so there will be the situational question as well for now what we are going to do we will prepare three questions only the basic one the very basic one first is introduce yourself okay for that you have a video you can go to our uh, youtube channel there is a video introduction by shubhya ma you can like uh, go through that and prepare your introduction accordingly after that why you want, want to join us because you are working so they might ask that why you left that job and why you want to join us only okay so this will be the second question that why you want to join us they, so you have to prepare a things that i uh, that uh, ma'am or sir where i was working recently i was very much satisfied with that the organization was good but now i want to explore more opportunities and i think your organization will give me a larger growth to my future in terms of knowledge in terms of monetary and in terms of stability that's why i'm looking for an organization like you that will give me a enhanced growth okay so uh, you what you have to do you don't have to like criticize your last organization you just have to like go a step ahead that this was good but now i want to grow more that's why i am looking for your organization okay? okay so this will be your second question and third question is saying that why you left your organization this will be also interlinked question okay, okay. so firstly we will prepare these three basic questions okay so just prepare these three question then book another slot we will move forward okay okay ma'am yeah and then we will prepare for the another questions like the related question yeah okay ma'am yeah anything else from your side you want to ask anything no ma'am okay 
okay prashant so best of luck just put these questions come again and we will go ahead then okay 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 yeah, it's 10, it's 10 days till you have a lot of time if you like put regular effort you will get a good grades yeah okay 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 all the best thank you ma'am